Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Quincy. I'm the founder of Good Looking AI, and we offer voice AI solutions to businesses to help them streamline operations and save time on manual work. In today's video, I'm going to be walking you through a quick guide on how to purchase a phone number on a telephony provider such as Twilio and how we can connect that number to a voice AI assistant on Vapi. So if you don't know how to do that yet, follow along with the video and let's get started. If you're on the Twilio free trial plan, there are some limitations. You can only purchase up to one number at a time and all the numbers that you want to call from to the number on Twilio and all the numbers that you want to call to with the number on Twilio will need to be verified. So that's one thing to keep in mind while you're on the free tw Twilio trial plan. Now to get started, you want to navigate to Twilio.com. You can create an account. You'll be given $15 of credit, I believe, that you can use in the free trial plan. And here you'll be taken to the Twilio console, which is your dashboard. So to get a number, we're gonna to navigate to phone numbers, manage, and buy a number. And here we can see we're given all these different phone numbers that we can purchase. Now, each of these phone numbers are gonna have its own capabilities. As we can see, we have the capabilities of voice, SMS, MMS, and fax with these phone numbers. Right? And then if you wanna further refine and get a specific phone number for a area code, uh, you can also provide that right here, search for that and purchase those numbers. But I'm just gonna click on this one right here. And you can see it's a dollar and 15 cents monthly fee but again you will be utilizing your free credit if you just created a new account with Twilio and the capabilities of the phone number is voice fax SMS and MMS and just keep in mind for the sake of this video I'm only going to be showing you how to connect the phone number to an assistant on Vapi if you are creating a workflow automation that incorporates SMS capabilities, you are going to need to register your phone number. As you can see right here, it says A2P 10 DLC registration is required for US messaging. So here, they're pretty much just gonna ask you business information, uh, what do you plan on sending in these SMS campaigns? And then you'll need to wait for approval once your phone number is approved for an SMS. And then you'll have the, the full capabilities to send out uh, text messages uh, in the workflow. But again, we'll only be purchasing the number and connecting it to Vapi. So I'm going to purchase this phone number right here. And then I'm gonna to go to active numbers. And then here we see the number that we just purchased. So I'm gonna click on this. And then we see here, it says, please add an emergency address to this phone number. You may incur a $75 charge. So we don't want that, of course. So we're gonna add an emergency address. I'm gonna create an address. And then add an emergency address. Cool. So now that we have the phone number purchased and we added that emergency address, let's navigate to Vapi. And here I want to connect this phone number to my assistant Ava. So I'm going to go to uh, phone numbers. And then I'm also going to create a phone number. And then I'm going to import from Twilio. Now here I just got to paste in the phone number that we just purchased on Twilio. So I'm gonna copy this. Or... Copy this number right here. And then the Twilio account SID. So we're gonna go into our account dashboard scroll down and here we're given the account SID copy this Twilio auth token which will be this right here and then label I'm just gonna give this demo number. and then import And then once we imported the number, we're gonna select the assistant and I'm gonna assign it to the Ava appointment center. 
and that should be it. So once we import the number in the Twilio console, if we go back to the active numbers and we click on the phone number, we can see that the webhook URL has been updated to point to API API.vapi.ai. So what this is, is when the number gets called, it's going to uh, send that call request to Vapi where the AI assistant is connected. Right. So that's pretty much going to be it. Very, very straightforward video. Hopefully you found value out of this video and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.